Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. Hashashin. <clears throat> Excuse me. Anyway, last time we joined the assassins, we made a determined effort, or a determined plan, to kill a Daddy Pants here so that we can inherit the uh, Sultanate of Egypt. How well will that work? No idea, but let's see how well it goes. My wife is pregnant, but I was away, so she probably cheated on me. Because I don't have paranoid. It's usually, if you have paranoid, that'll pop up for all of your kids. Anyway, hopefully it's something good. Still want to play around with some of these options. I don't think borrowing money would be a good idea. <laughs> but we'll see. Uh, you know, I might just let it go. It might not be mine, but that's not going to matter in the long run. Let's look around, because I've never actually started playing a campaign this late. I don't know exactly what's going on during this time period. Okay, so we have Castile here. Uh, they've already united under King Alfonso the Brave. So they're probably going to be beating up on these Muslim miners pretty handily. We have France here. It looks like England ha holds Normandy, obviously, because William the Conqueror is ruling in England. Uh, late nights, the way my wife has stopped touching me or even looking at me, and now whispers of her and that foul brute, my half-brother, I can't take it anymore. Uh, psh, yeah, that's basically what I expected. He doesn't like me. <laughs> he's my rival and my half-brother. Of course he's sleeping with my wife. I don't need proof when I have poison! <laughs> My fellows in the Assassins have informed me that Balik Bay... Balik? Bay... Sinan plans to travel to realm incognito for a lark, mingling with the common folk. People should really not do that. Because it's the default, I am going to catch you thing. Okay, so we have captured this guy. Now the question is, if I assa if I execute him, just straight up execute him right now, will that count? I mean, I'm not going to get any intrigue against him. Let's find out. Hanged on the order of a me. My target has died at my hands. Aha! Complete the assassinate mission. That's sort of unfortunate. I I still would have liked it if if the I uh, I still need something real. If the assassination events were actually unique to the assassins. Okay, I've become an intricate web weaver. That's good. Boy, my intrigue's gone up. <laughs> I need to go back and look to see what my intrigue was at the start of the game. Oh, hey! My brother died. Oh, I wonder who did that. Nobody knows. It's a secret. I believe that'll mean that Daddy Pants here will it have inherited all of his lands. Or maybe it was my other half-brother. It's hard to say. He could give them to me. That would be nice, but he's not going to. Did I always have this? Did I always have Aswan? Maybe I did. I might I might I might have had it. Try to focus on my training, but he is always there. 
No matter if I'm studying in the Great Order Library, hid behind piles of books or sparring with us fellow assassin, Mayor Behrad apparently has to do the same. And his taunt and snide comments are driving me mad. I could either kill him, or ach attempt to kill him with a challenge. Uh, personal combat minus one. I would probably win? Might have a number of options depending on whether you win or lose and how he takes it. You might learn a permanent or temporary skill, get injured, gain a new friend, or declare a new rival. Or I could ignore him and focus on my training and get plus two intrigue, plus one learning and personal combat. Let's try this one. Maybe something interesting will happen. Anyway. Oh, oh, okay then. Bay Cunyad of Tiberias or Tiberias must die. Oh, I actually have quite a bit of intrigue against him. But, again, nobody will join my plot, so I'm not going to be able to do it that way. I'll have to abduct him. And that is my primary issue so far with this. With this society. Put a word on my butt rather than that he needs to die. Great. Okay, so we have Persia over here. I would pause the game, but... While I get look around, but I don't want to. Mayor Behrad was not slow to accept my challenge. It was a simple one. Both craft disguises under the nearby town. <laughs> if he even wins this, I will be pissed. Three intrigue versus 19 intrigue. Ah, uh, okay. We have the Sultan of Rum up here. Sweating underneath my heavy robes and veal in the relentless noon sun. Where was Mayor Befraud? I scanned the crowd nervously, but nothing. And then, the coolness of a blade against my throat. What? Oh, come on. How did he beat me? Dom. Dom. Well, at least we became friends. Still, what the heck? Okay, my wife gave birth to a daughter. That's unfortunate. I would much prefer a son. Okay, the Byzantine Empire doesn't look so hot in this time period. There we go. That's better. Ali, that's fine. And that was even this person. So that's... No, no, that wasn't that person. Are all of my wives unfaithful? No, just this one. Okay, fair enough. Not having much luck in their attempts to abduct him. Keep trying. Okay, not so much is happening in... My wife is pregnant. Great. In Russia yet. And... It looks like Scandinavia is still pretty fractured. Okay. Alright. Holy Roman Empire, of course, in the middle. Been overcome with fatigue and troubled by a persistent cough. And this is why we have a court physician. Hopefully he does a good job. Well, he does a good job. Um, sure, I'll give him a couple of ducats. A few pennies. I am a little bit concerned. Because... Okay, it looks like Daddy Pants is going after... What, Mercuria? I assume Mercuria. Yep. I can imagine a situation where... Which became more and more intimidating. I want to become brave. There we go. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm a little bit concerned because we do have this Persia. We have the Seljuks up here. They have 22,000 men. Daddy Pants, he only has 5,000 men. That's not good. If Persia decides they want to attack, evade, and kill me, they'll be perfectly able to do so. 
So I'm actually on the side of the Catholics in this. I really hope they succeed. Because that will draw their attention away. Unfortunately, it looks like the Sultan of Rum is helping. The Sultan of Rum. Nope, I still need something new. Something real. I could also attack... One of these factions, try to get a bit bigger, and head this way. That could be something that I do. I mean, this Sultan of Africa, he only has 3,000 men. I have more than that. The problem is that these holy wars, any Sunni Muslim who wants to can join against me. And they might. And if that happens, then I guess I'll lose. Anyway, something happened. And I wasn't paying attention to it. Okay, I got another son from this wife. And he's sickly, so I'm going to ask my court physician to attempt to fix that. Yeah, let's go ahead and try to strike out at Sirencia. Why not? We'll see what happens. Expand our borders a little bit. I mean, I mostly want to play for the Assassins. I don't want to do anything super fancy. As, well, I suppose we are only starting like 20 years after the start of the game. So, like the original start of the game. So, it is possible we could pull off something fancy. And, he had a successful treatment. So, now he's less likely to die of being sickly. He could still die, but it's unlikely. It's unlikely for them to die from sickly anyway. I've had it happen a few times, but not many. My marshal, my other wife is sick. That's great. My marshal wants to increase council power. That's dumb. Stop that. Join the assassins. Nope. I'm, an, I'm a fanatic, apparently. Okay. Okay. Let's use these fancy drugs. Ah, huh? I like drugs. <laughs> Kids, don't use drugs. It, it's time to open my mind to visions of paradise. <laughs> this will ensure the, ensure the steadiness of my hand... And I, as I act on behalf of the Order, but how much do I dare reveal to myself? Uh, use all of it. Yep, all of it. It's fine, I'm sure. Doing all the drugs will be perfectly fine. So my mind perceives the world in new and unexpected ways. The shapes in the smoke filling my chamber crystallize and I begin to understand. The wisdom of the past written in ashen clouds. Truth-seeking gaze, plus two learning. Well, that's not very useful. Visions have revealed much to me. I understand much more now, even a hint of my own place in the great mosaic of God's plan. Plus one to everything for a year. Eh, still not that great. I was expecting more. But I suppose... Hey, he's going to travel incognito for a... Okay, have fun with that. And they failed. Great. Well, we'll keep trying, because, like I said, I'm not going to be able to assassinate him with a regular plot. He's not in my realm. Okay, let's go ahead and siege down Tobruk. My dad, Daddy Pants... Do something bad. Try to kill someone. I could try to kill him. But nobody would be on board for it. That sucks. No, I just have to be patient. Patience is a virtue. Okay. So go ahead and speed up the game a little bit. 
till something interesting happens. Not having much luck. I keep working on it. Don't give up. Don't give up until I tell you to give up. And then you can give up. That is the way that thing works. You can spend some time investigating one of your leader's vassals and feel you've gathered enough evidence to gain leverage that would discourage him from joining a faction. Okay. Well, what's going on here? Okay, it looks like... One of my sons has mysteriously perished. Neat. Okay, are you sure it's not just because he's sickly? Anyway, it looks like uh, Tripolitania has joined this war. I don't know if I can beat... both of them. The only thing I can do, though, is try. Now I'm in this war, I might as well. Okay, let's go ahead and fill out our... commander positions here. My wife is pregnant. Well, I guess it didn't take long to replace this guy, did it? <laughs> Covenant Steward has led a group of smugglers into the country. That's great. That's just perfect. Well, I guess he does have a zero stewardship. Let's fix that real quick. That's better. <laughs> Should have really fixed all of these. As much as I can, at least. Something that I wasn't really concerning myself with. Anyway, should I... I wonder if I should just collect taxes in my capital. Let's see. That improves my domain. Increases culture conversion and prosperity gain. I'll go ahead and collect taxes. He's a good enough steward for that. Okay, so I actually did capture him. Let's go ahead and kill him. That's fine. There we go. I spooked the enemy. Ooh. Ooh. We might win that. We should win that, yeah. That was a little concerning. I will admit, I wasn't too sure if I was going to win that. <laughs> Turns out I had nothing to worry about. Could hire some mercenaries, but I don't really have the money for doing such a thing. Unfortunate. Let's see. I wonder if we get more bonuses on our plot power as we improve. Probably not. Okay, regulated inheritance. Which one was that? Controlled realm inheritance. Right. So he doesn't want titles passing from the realm. That's not really a concern for Muslim rulers. Okay, so my wife is pregnant again. I'm trying to focus on my training, but he's always there. This guy... Well, not this guy, but this event again. I mean, I challenged a guy with horrible intrigue last time, and I lost. I don't know if I want to attempt to do so again. <laughs> Let's do it. Whatever. I'm not really playing this game to be perfect or the most powerful. Okay, so now I have to kill this guy. No chance in hell. But we'll try to kidnap him and do it that way. Again. This isn't the most exciting thing. Okay. Uh, decided not to complicate anything. A duel at midday. Ooh. He and I actually have the same personal combat skill. I might lose this. Of course... It doesn't really matter. I tried to do Intrigue last time, and I uh, lost to get that, too. So, whatever. Evenly matched. Uh, I had tried to give my very hardest to keep him at bay. A drop of sweat fell in my eye, and I instinctively raised my hand to wipe it away, and he nicked my arm. I suck at these challenges. I am just awful at them. Okay, a daughter was born. That's fair. I could marry my daughter to the... or betrothed, it's not marriage. 
to the Sultan of Persia. I think I might do that, actually. Because, eventually I am going to be the Sultan of Egypt, and I don't want him to eat me. <laughs> I do not... I am not delicious. And he accepted. Hopefully he keeps up his end of the bargain. He is actually really good for an... Well, no. He's eight years old, two and everything. That's... No, just have to be patient. Okay, are they going to come in and attack me again? No, they're going to go siege down that province. Negative 6.5, negative 5.1. I should be able to siege this province down in time? I think. During this evening's council meeting, Count Mullah Salim told us of a rumor he had encountered. The peasants speak of an artifact hidden not far away from here. The specifics of his information are uncertain, but perhaps it would be worth investigating. Uh, sure. Let's investigate. Inform me that we're traveling incognito with the common folk, okay? And I captured him, and he is dead. Yeah. Twelve. Okay, yeah, I should. I should be able to. I am now known as the Flare. That's okay. Now let's go kick them off, if we can. I hope we can. I hope we can win this battle. It's going to be another close one. Oh, actually, never mind. It looks like I'm going to beat them pretty soundly. Well... I don't know. My morale here in the center dipped quite a bit, and on the left flank, but... Dipping doesn't matter, as long as I successfully won. Sadly, I cannot actually chase their army down anymore, because they added the Shattered Retreat mechanic from Europa Universalis. And that's fine. Okay, this is actually becoming kind of a problem. 74 opinion of me, and he's still joining a faction. Okay. Alright, game. We'll give you some money. And we'll also give you an honorary title. Ah, okay, so that's that's what we do. Huh. Slim Spent many weeks spent over Angel Tomes regarding rumored artifacts. Claims to be on the right path. So what does this do? Oh, that's Recruit to the Assassins. I thought it said search for the artifact. Ah, my eyes, my brain. My wife is sick. Okay, so it looks like they stopped there. That's fine. I thought they were going to run all the way over there. Okay, well, I'll just attack them again. Easy peasy. Okay, how much garrison do these guys have? Eight, nine hundred-ish. Slightly more. We'll have better luck sieging down this province, especially because it's a mosque and not a... castle. Okay, despite having a 15 stewardship, we managed to hit the 8%. No, not the 8%. We managed to make the peasants angry because of high taxes. Great. That's perfect. Okay, we need Castle Infrastructure 4 to build a town. We're nowhere near that. Do we have any provinces that need to be converted? We do actually have a couple of them. 
Not sure why I didn't check that sooner. I guess because I wasn't paying attention. Uh, the crusade for Jerusalem failed. The Pope was captured in battle and released. <laughs> He's a true Christian knight. So it would seem. Well, that is unfortunate. These guys are still wanting to increase crown authority. Okay, I will give you money. Will you stop your shenanigans? No. No, you're not. I'd just like to note... That... They like me. They really like me. But they still want to increase... Okay, there we go. Fair enough. <laughs> just took them a few seconds. Anyway, yeah, I... I, that is one thing that's frustrated me about uh, the recent incarnation of Crusader Kings 2. Not the most recent one, but ever since Conclave. I don't mind Conclave. I don't mind the idea of the council. The council actually having power to do stuff. Because that's pretty much how it was. There was no such thing as an absolute monarch outside of maybe the Byzantine Empire during this time period. That didn't rise up until the next <laughs> the next game. The next time period period. The Enlightenment, uh, colonialism, that that time period, like the 14, 15, 16, 17, 1800s, that was when the idea of the absolute monarch came about. So the idea of having a council that moderates and curbs the power of a king, that idea is fine. The problem with that idea in this game is that it leads to situations... How many people do you have? Okay. I hope he can handle that, because I can't. <laughs> anyway, yeah, the idea of a council to curb the monarch's power is fine, but because of the way it's set up, even if they like you, they're going to join factions, they're going to want increased council power, they're going to want, not maybe not necessarily independence, but definitely the increased council power. I see that a lot, and I mean a lot even when they have no business joining that faction. Even if they're all loyalists, they love me, all of that, they will still join and attempt to pull off a increased council power faction. I'm going to hire mercenaries, and I'm going to try to link them up with my main army. I think I could probably win that? Especially now that they've taken attrition. Okay, well, I just... I already paid for those mercenaries. I might as well use them. I was going to say, eh, I don't think I can beat them. But then they just lost a quarter of their army for some reason. Okay, I'm not going to be able to siege this down in time, so I'm going to go ahead and attack them. Whoops. Didn't quite get there to stop him from moving into that province in time, but that's okay. So we have another son born to our first wife. We have a lot of kids. It probably has something to do with us having 800 bajillion wives. Just, just, just the thought. Now, are there any, like, geniuses? Strong? Quick? No. There's a few strong people, but they're, like, three years old. Okay, go ahead and marry her, I suppose. Sadly, in this early part of the game, there's not really that much variety with marriage. Sometimes there'll be a quick, strong genius. Probably not a quick, strong genius, but a quick, strong, or genius. Yeah, that's better. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and win this war, because I think I can. Okay, once again, this guy is being a dick, 
And we're going to challenge him to a challenge of some kind. Okay, this is a new mission. Uh, it's time is night for your subjects in Alexandria to adopt the true religion. When a majority of the population in this county has converted to the Shia faith, your mission is complete. What a coincidence. I just sent my court chaplain, court mullah, there. Unfortunately, he has a 1% chance of converting a county because he is awful. But I will try, because I'm sure my uh, daddy pants is also trying to convert provinces. Maybe not that one specifically. Okay, a duel. Again, a pair of daggers. I have a higher personal combat skill, so I should have the slight advantage. In theory. Evenly matched. I do not remember when we had lost our weapons. Now we're wrestling on the ground. That is getting enough of an advantage. Sweat soaking our clothes. And it was a draw. And we became close friends. So that's kind of neat. It seems like there's a fairly common event where the assassins just befriend everybody. But everybody in the order, I should say. But... I need 750 divine power to rank up to companion. Oh man, this is going to take forever. This siege, that is. Oh, it's a castle. That's why. Well, they're both castles. So they're going to take forever to siege down regardless. Okay. You want to be my first wife. Let's look at your stat line. She... no. Well... She has more diplomacy. She has better stats all around, but... Uh, Sakmas here has more stewardship. I like my domain size. So, how about... No. Okay, we could use drugs again. I don't think I'm going to bother with that. We could also go ahead and observe Ramadan again if we were at peace. Court Mullah was discovered charging money for various religious favors. Can I kick him out? I can. Aha! That means I can actually get somebody worth a damn as my Court Mullah. 4%. Yeah, that's only like four times better than the previous guy. It's still not great, but I, that's probably because our moral authority is quite low because we don't have many of the holy sites. Looks like Najaf. Slim can no longer s fulfill his duty. Why? I can select another counselor to replace him. Okay. Well, how about we have the new guy, new guy search for the artifact? He's 65. That might not be a good idea. It'll be fine, I'm sure. I believe when we siege this province down, we will win the battle, the battle, the war. No, not quite. Okay, well, that is all the time that I have for today. Unfortunately, I was hoping to finish this war. We will do that. Ooh. The Persians are having a bit of a revolt over here. Uh, whatever. Anyway. We will finish this war next time. We will hopefully convert this province. And we will continue to see what the assassins have for us. But until then, happy gaming.